it's John Mackin alongside here, my buddy Pat Cash. We are psyched and pumped up for a great day of tennis. Absolutely, let's go for it. Here we have another great matchup between two contrasting styles and two great rivals. John McEnroe and Bjorn Borg. To the left of the chair, John McEnroe. Borg, you like to serve. Time. I'll expect a fantastic match today between these two. Let's get into it. Oh, that's a well-timed volley across court for the winner. The pros and cons are hitting your shots deep. The pros are you give your opponent less time to come up with a pass and less confidence that he'll be able to do something with it. The cons, none. from McEnroe. How did he manage to do that? Well, players down left 30. Now, what do you do now? You try to just go for even more, take something off it, stay back? Do you switch gears that fast? Well, you think uh, the first couple of points have been a bit rusty, so I think he's got to be hoping that, uh, you know, gets a bit of rhythm here. Maybe not go for something too crazy. Just try and get a good solid point and hope the opponent misses. good to handcuff your opponent and maybe not allow him to extend himself off the ground in the ground strokes but basically when you get out of a court this is a matter a test of wills and a test of fitness and you want to see how well your opponent hits on the run and what type of level of fitness he's got Right there. Oh, it's important to get the first break, isn't it? I mean, it's always important to get it, but early on in this set, that's absolutely crucial. Well, early in the set, get the edge psychologically, some confidence, get things rolling in your favor. Well done, man. All right, the player is looking to consolidate on serve after breaking their opponent. If he can get the service hold here, he can really take control of this match. Well, that's a great cross-court forehand winner. Okay, Mac, another pro and con for attacking the net. Well, guys, pass better than ever. So you better be ready for a quick and concise volley, okay? The other thing is more topspin employed than ever before. So you really need to keep your eye on the ball. Otherwise, it would be a serious con. What kind of serve is that? Second, serve. second serve's important, otherwise might be attacked. Oh, well, a double fault, uh, it's, gonna, it's disappointing. First serve. That's a great shot. Forehand down the line winner. Oh, that's a great return. Time that for a winner. Back to Deuce. The player has a break point after just having been broken. 
That often happens in tennis. You lose your serve, but you refocus and bring the intensity up and try to get that break right back. Oh, what a forehand winner, right across court. Well, this is a this is a real fight between these two. I expected him to fight on. Well, that takes some touch. He's hit a beautiful lob winner there. Well, back the juice yet again. <laughs> well, he tried to sneak in, but he was uh, he was ready for it. He knew exactly what was going on. like a bit of trouble for a while. It was looking tight there. It's a good thing he found his game before he gave up that break. Well, he's in big trouble in this set. I mean, he really does have to just concentrate on the very first point of this service game. Oh, up and over. That's a beautiful lob. Easy smash put away. What do you mean? Well, he's almost out of this match, but uh, there's a bit of a comeback coming here. And uh, of course, that's to keep rebuilding right here right now and unforced errors are the key uh, don't go for too many crazy things and keep continue to put pressure on the opponent let's see if he's got the nerve to hold on well he's in the right position now johnny say uh, serving for the match should he go for the lines or should he play safely yeah, that's a great question because you get to this winning position and you often change gears here but you get a little bit of tight and you start missing first serves and allow your opponent back in the match the same token, keep playing the same, you figure the guy's going to start to figure it out sooner or later. So it's a bit of a dilemma here, serving for the match. Well, there's no pressure when you have to hit the ball down the middle for a winner. That's a great play. Well, what a way to set up a match point with a clean winner. Well, this is what it's all about. Match point. And that's it. It's been a good match. And uh, in the end, the 
Robinson. So I, I tell you, there's an incredible sense of relief when you finally get that match under your belt. Every match counts. You want to get those nerves out. Then you can sort of let it go a little bit more and play your best tennis. Well, that's about all the action we have for you today. I'm Pat Cash, sitting alongside John McEnroe, wishing you all the best.